Hi, welcome to Adam Tech Tips, and I'm making an eight-way blend space. So we got the forward animation, we got the backwards, we got the left one, we got the right one, and we got this. Sorry, I it it might needs more <laughs> adjusting. Now I want to do an idle one, so I need a lower type of. The animation so this is from layer starter game uh, but it doesn't actually have lower idle animation so we only have this idle and idle have fire and we have this idle break fidget so I think I'm not gonna use this but I don't want the starting and ending which is it was about that thing so let's uh, duplicate this to our Folder. So this is widget idle break widget. So I'm going to put this on lower. I'm going to copy it here, and uh, let's uh, rename it idle lower. Then I just want to cut it. So the idle lower. I don't want the first one and the back one. So let's just start from here. Maybe I'm just going to put an, a marker to say it's from 69, and it's the most similar thing on 192. And I'm just going to cut it. So the quick way to cut it is actually you scrub the timeline to here, and then if you right click, you can remove uh, the beginning one from remove zero to frame 1969. So it start at there. And I want to throw the maybe 123, 124. Remove frame 125 to 182 and that's how you trim out your animation now your animation is lowered see and to take a next step further i'm just going to blend it actually so mf uh, rifle lowered let's duplicate this mf rifle lowered too and we have this one and i actually want to make this uh, seamless from the start to end I don't want it to snap so what I can do uh, pretty quick is just use this button edit in sequencer uh, back to control rig and just the CR mannequin body you can have this if you have a control rig exists for your character just like in this layer starter game you might want to create a new uh, control rig if you character doesn't have this so I'm just going to click this and by default it's going to be 0.001 i'm going to lower it to 0.1 because my laptop is pretty low spec and you will be bro with this so you will be spawned in a sequencer who's driving the actual animation and this window is going to bake your animation to the control rig so i'm just going to bake the control rig and here we are we have the animation keys so you can do uh, animate manually like this but what i want what i really like is just by adding another animation so the this one sorry let's just copy the name and then add animation lower to be like that and if we disable this we should see it's driving from lower and I'm just going to a little bit of the script here I don't want to actually use uh, the controller since um, I'm not messing with that uh, so I'm just going to disable it I want it to set the play rate to 0.8 and then let's start not at the beginning but at this rate and let's uh, split this split section and let's just trim it like this and then let's set the play rate maybe 0.9 so it's blending at this angle maybe let's just separate oh no no we can do this yes so make sure the blending is like this way the x blend so it smoothly blend to the our beginning like this and in theory it will be looping now see now it's looping and we hit save and if we check our lower we should have it looping see <laughs> we 
we get some kind of glitch maybe let's disable this and maybe let's just trim out this section now it should be looping and that's how we trim out segments and then make it looping for our purpose of creating the idle animation uh, you can do this with any animation you want and then yeah see you in another video thank you for watching